did the medium change the light bulb? I don't know. Why did the medium change the light bulb? So it could show us the light. <laughs> it's awful. <Yeah. laughs> Hello there. Welcome to the second Compton Cafe. My name's Mark English. And I'm Annalisa Foster. Hope you can enjoy the show. We've got loads coming up today. So let's get started, eh? Yep. It's been quite a busy time with uh, Spiral lately, hasn't it? Very much um, so. Yeah, we just done um, Derby Jow with those great guys at Phantom Force. Uh, we're along with Mark Webb and special guest uh, Richard Felix. <laughs> Um, very, very cool evening that was. You've just been on holiday though, haven't you? Yes, 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 it was lovely. It was lovely. Yeah, and you were a bit uh, back a day late though, weren't you? Yes, we shan't mention that little bit, shall we? Airports don't love them. So yes, it's all been very cool. We've had some really good investigations. We've got some great investigations coming up. Alan and I have been joining Compass Paranormal recently. We've been to Cole House Fort. And also we did the old Beneficial School in Portsmouth with Barry. And um, that was for the Keith Bennett appeal. And that was a really good, interesting location. So I hope you might be able to get back there soon. A new magazine is out uh, called UFO Matrix, which is available from all good uh, news agents. Uh, edited by Philip Mantle, a very renowned uh, UFO researcher, and Malcolm Robinson is a deputy ed editor. Uh, we actually interviewed Malcolm back in episode 7, I think it was, sort of uh, one of our spiral episodes. Uh, very, very well written magazine, very informative, I thoroughly recommend it. This really is, really is what we've been waiting for, so I really, really recommend UFO Matrix. Go and buy it in the news agents or subscribe. Well, our friend Barry John, uh, who does a lot of work with our friends um, Compass Paranormal, mm -hmm. has a new CD out this week. Oh, the one about ghost hunting, yes, that he did with uh, Jackie Newcomb, that's right, yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, here's the man himself. Hi, I'm Barry John. I've recently launched a new CD. It's a ghost hunting workshop to help you and your team to be able to do a professional ghost hunt. Remember, ghost hunting is all about proof and proof of life after death. What we want to do is be able to open this up to so many people. You can buy the Ghost Hunting CD via my website, which is www.barryjohn.com. Our friends at Compass Paranormal have got some upcoming events for the rest of September and beginning of October. What have we got? Well, on the... She's on the sleep. <laughs> no, too much. She's had too much of this. She's had too much of this. Not at all. On the 24th of September, we have Bolton Castle with guest medium Barry John. You're so posh. Mm, very much very so. Posh. They do try, darling. They do, darling. Uh, on Saturday the 25th of September, they're doing Whittington Castle. On Friday the 1st of October, we've got Margham Castle again with guest medium Barry John. Mm -hmm. Uh, Saturday the 9th of October is Dudley Castle, once again with Barry John. On uh, Saturday the 9th of uh, October we have Preston Manor. That's with a guest medium. Uh, they've also, uh, I spoke to Richard today and they actually booked some great locations for 2011. So go to their website, compassparanormalevents.co.uk and uh, book your tickets. The Daily Mail reported uh, about the selling of Wimmering Manor in Portsmouth. Now I'm sure a lot of investigators have been there over the years. Really, really good place. We've been there. Uh, I've got there many, many times. Um, and on the Daily Mail website, Daily Mail Online, they've actually linked one of our episodes from Wimmering Manor, which has shocked us slightly. It's episode 33, which we did last year in 2009 with Norrie Miles. Um, and there has been 21,000 hits. <laughs> That's right, 21,000 hits so far, which has sort of thrown us a little bit. It's a bit of a shame actually, because on our YouTube channel, we've actually only got the 10 minute version. Uh, there is actually a 20 minute version, the full episode, which you can download from our site. Cheap plug. But yeah, so uh, if you haven't seen that Wimmering and Manor episode, uh, here's our YouTube link uh, and check it out. We had a great night here uh, last night, which was between Thursday the 16th of September, where Dr Kieran O'Keefe did an evening of parapsychology here, had a lot of great guests coming along as well, and um, that was in aid of the Keith Bennett appeal, and we had a very, very cool night here at Beyond the Senses. And here is the first in a series of Dr Kieran O'Keefe's Paranormal Tips. Hello, I'm Dr Kieran O'Keefe, and I'm here to talk to you about ghost tech. Those high-tech gadgets you use in a haunted location to measure the environment. This tip is about temperature. Frequently you find in a ghost hunter's kit the laser thermometer. And too often I see this used incorrectly. When you point it at a surface, a laser appears on the surface, whether it's the floor, or the table, or even people's skin or clothes. But remember guys, 
what you're actually measuring is the surface temperature. So when people report a cold spot, don't think that you can measure that cold spot with the laser thermometer. You can't. The laser essentially shoots straight through that suspected cold spot. If you do want to measure it and you've got a particular form of laser thermometer, what I do suggest is getting hold of something called a thermocouple. A lot of laser thermometers have the sockets on their handle, which means you can attach a laser thermometer and you can actually be measuring the air temperature as well as the surface temperature with the laser. Our friend Tim Brown from The Pigs, uh, some of you may have read his articles in Ghost Voices magazine, they do some great events. Um, they've got their latest Random Tangent video coming out very, very soon, uh, Random Tangent 17. Here's a quick clip of Tim. Uh, Random Tangents last aired back in the times when things aired uh, a while ago, which means basically I can't remember the date. Uh, but uh, there will be a new season of Tangents coming because I really, really enjoyed doing them. And I really love the feedback that was coming from them. The new season, Random Tangents, will come to you at some point in September. And I do hope that you enjoy. So go to their website, thepigs.co.uk, and uh, you can download. If you go to the Silent Voices website, details below, Okay, um, you're going to find some really interesting articles, very informative, okay, on the world of the paranormal and on spirituality. spirituality yeah, run by our friend Sharon Barr. Here it is, the website once again. Really interesting stuff. Yeah, yeah definitely. Uh, we've got some trailers coming up now uh, and some little clips. This is from uh, both Chris Holden from Haunted Earth, which I'm sure a lot of people who are into paranormal actually follow his uh, YouTube channel. Uh, he's got many, many, many subscribers, creates really, really cool videos. So I really, really recommend you go and subscribe. And followed by that, we're going to be uh, showing the trailer for the Ghosts of Fort Amherst which was a charity event we did for uh, Compass Paranormal in aid of Help for Heroes back in February with special guest Frank Bruno. So here's the trailers for that. Hi, as many of you know me as Chris Holton, I am the leader of Haunted Earth Paranormal Investigations. We've got a sizable presence on Facebook at uh, Haunted Earth UK. And if you pop over to YouTube, I've got a full selection of over 200 videos of the paranormal. So. Hopefully we'll be able to see you guys over there pop in and say hello. And of course, in the future, we will be working a little bit more closely on some projects with Mark English. So we're looking forward to that. And uh, thank you for tuning in and saying hello. Mark, I want to talk to uh, everyone about Looser Women. Looser Women, the upcoming radio show on the 20th of October. Yep. Actually, can I interrupt you there? Because actually I've got Denise Mott and Norrie Miles who will be on Looser Women radio show to tell you all about it. We're Loose Women. Join us on the 20th of October for, on the KPN for a night Join us if you dare. Look at that Okay, what guests are coming up on UKPN Radio? Uh, from Sam Brown, Gary Brown, Stuart Tidmarsh and Darren Longhurst. 
great presenters, great show. On Sunday the 26th of September is Billy Roberts. Uh, he was on recently on Most Haunted. Uh, Sunday the 3rd of October is a Spiral special. Who? Oh? Spiral. No? Spiral Paranormal? Doesn't ring a bell. No? No, not a clue. Don't know them. 10th of October is Cal Cooper, who is a very up-and-coming parapsychologist. Uh, and actually, here he is. Join me on the 10th of October on UKPN Radio, where I'll be talking about my research in parapsychology and telephone calls from the dead. See you there. So that's it for this edition of Quantum Cafe. Annalisa, you've had a good time? I've had a fabulous it's time. It's lovely to have you on the sofa. Don't read too much. How about it? Don't read too much. Don't read too much. So thanks for coming on the sofa with me. Uh, it's been absolutely enjoyable. <laughs> Hope you join us for the next Quantum Cafe in October. Hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, don't forget to visit all the websites. And uh, we'll bid you farewell. Cheers. Cheers.